Hi there, welcome to Get Data Solution. Today we'll see about risk matrix. Uh, in the earlier version, we have uh, seen a uh, risk matrix, which is four by three, which is the impact level are four and the likelihood are actually three. Today we'll see about the risk matrix four by four, which is the likelihood are four and the impact level is also four. We have also version three, which is four, five by five, where the impact level is five levels and the likelihood is also five. So our focus for today is version two. So uh, coming to this, the likelihood are actually defined like this. If the probability of occurring is less than 25%, it is unlikely. If the probability of occurring is 26 to 50%, this, that may be occur. And if the probability is 51 to 75%, it's likely to occur. And if it is greater than 75%, percent probability that will be high highly likely that is the defined term is for likelihood in this particular case and for the impact level little or no impact to project or client that is acceptable if that condition is there based on the actual condition on the ground the effects are felt but not critical that will be tolerable if it is a serious impact to client or project goals or outcomes that is an acceptable level and could have disastrous impact to client or project goals or outcomes just that will be intolerable so these are uh, four impact levels and four likelihood levels so based on that we'll have here uh, different options from low level moderate level high and extremely high uh, options and we'll have here also uh, the values the values will be actually here uh, set and here is the decision based on our selection levels so currently we have 38 is the total aggregate value and the decision is the project is moderately good in this particular case we have four low cases three moderate cases four high cases and five extremely high cases even though we have uh, five extra high cases the project is moderately good so we can go with it without any further making a decision for rejection of the project so if we change these values we'll actually have uh, different decision and different values so uh, let let me actually change some of uh, the options and see the difference in terms of uh, our decision making let's make let's make this low moderate low Hello. Here, for example, we can make it moderate. Here, we can make it moderate. Uh, okay. So, 
at this point we have actually selected uh, eight uh, in low po possibilities for moderate possibility one high and three extremely high in this case this is the project the decision will be the project is in good progress so once we actually be select uh, the possibilities from low moderate high and extremely high cases based on uh, the knowledge we have about the likelihood and the impact levels we can actually uh, make decision based on the values given here so this is very important for uh, making informed decisions which is one of the reason uh, one of the purpose of this channel so having said this let's come to the purpose of this get the, this channel which is get data solution uh, this data solution provide different uh, tools like dashboard and different tools for managing the project and the business this are some of the purposes of this channel to modernize the data system to save time to generate automatic report to reduce cost to increase productivity to manage project and to manage business as well as to learn new skills here are the reason why you should actually subscribe to our channel and if you are actually new to our channel please consider subscribing to our channel uh, because you will get some of the benefit from this channel the first one is it will actually help you and provide you your uh, business in terms of uh, using different templates it will help you to manage your project if you are actually working on project for example today's topic risk matrix can help you uh, it will help you to manage your work to automate your activity and make you free from hustle and bustle it will increase your productivity once you automate your activity your productivity will increase so that we will actually engage on other important factors you you can actually uh, come across new skills that you should uh, learn in the course of the time and based on information you will make informed decision for your project or for your business so this is the reason why you should subscribe to our channel for today's topic which is a risk matrix based on the likelihood and the impact i think you can actually uh, as you have seen this template is uh, providing us based on our input uh, and guiding us to make informed decisions so one of uh, the purposes you can realize it here and it will also uh, automate your activity with simple input in this case is simple clicking and selecting the options that will increase your productivity so that is why the this channel is actually uh, aiming to uh, support business and the project in terms of making uh, automatic report and increasing productivity for business as well so uh, that's all for today if you actually like to uh, see the benefit of this you can find here and this is recommended also for this group of people and you can also ins see the instruction page here for how to insert the values and the main uh, message for today is this will actually benefit in terms of uh, this for example automatically generating ratings 
and this is recommended for this group of people and that's all for today and bye bye